Welcome back to Love and Junk Food. I'm Laura. I'm John. And today we're trying very random things we've never tried before. So sometimes we're just going out shopping. We go to various stores. We go to Aldi. We go to Walmart. We go to our local grocery store. And we'll see something and we're like, we got to try that. But we like to try to group these things together mm -hmm. so that we can make a video of it. These are things that we picked up and really don't fit any other category. That's so. right. So we're lumping them together. Yeah. We have, this is from Aldi. This is pretzel slims. I almost said slimes. Um, <laughs> bacon habanero Ooh. little pretzel crackers. John really likes that with dip. Yeah. The Could, pretzel chips. I've never had the bacon habanero. Right. Um, so who knows? Okay. Next <clears throat> we've had goldfish crackers a million times, mm -hmm. the different flavor blasted and whatever, but goldfish also makes pretzels. Never have we ever. And John loves pretzels. So I'm going to try those and see yeah. what we think. Those can't be bad, right? And these are jelly cream pies and this is little Debbie's and it's strawberry flavor. One of the things that we really love around Christmas time is they come out with a similar item that is cherry cordial. Mm -hmm. And that is delicious. So it'd be good to try this. So that is half jelly and half cream. Ooh. So I think that'll be good. And then, uh, you know, we've been talking a lot about curry and we picked up some different curry sauces. This is like um, ramen noodles, instant noodle, whatever, pot noodles, whatever you call them, where you live. It's that but curry. Yep, yep. So we're gonna let that sit and steep and hang out and that's right. And calm down a little bit. Which one do you wanna maybe we should go one of these first? Sure. Okay, what do you think? That one maybe? Uh, alright, let's let's just hit the spicy one, right? Okay. Hopefully it's not spicy. All I know is it's sticky. Something's on this and I don't like it. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> I don't know. No, come back. You can at least try this. No, it is all, it's on that too, on that goldfish. It's everywhere. No, it isn't. It is, I see it. <laughs> it was like a marshmallow goop. No, it isn't. Huh? You are like a three-year-old. No, it was bad. You're you like, oh, it's sticky. Here, you and he ran off. Look at it. You touch it. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. John's back from having to wash his hands because something was sticky. Oh my gosh, there's something all over this bag and on the goldfish. I don't know what it is. It's like frosting or something or like <laughs> marshmallow. Oh, it's all over. It's so sticky. All right. All right. What are these supposed to be? Bacon <laughs> they habanero. They look like little glasses. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Bacon habanero. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Do they taste spicy to you? Mm mm. I get I get the flavor of like mm, dog treat bacon. That's what it tastes like. And yeah. no habanero whatsoever. It's not spicy at all. Nothing. And the pretzel is not great. Dog treats for sure. Dog treat. Bacon. It tastes like what dog treats smell, smell like. like. Mm -hmm. For sure. All that right. Is, that's not good. Yeah. Well, we'll put them up for Easter. A lot of times <laughs> Clancy's is pretty good. So. Yeah. Here. Close that up. <laughs> ah, ah! You got me again. <laughs> You're trying to get rid of the stickiness. All right. Here. Yeah. Those. Those. I can't recommend. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. Goldfish. Pretzel goldfish. These can't be too bad, right? I love I have to say, these are kind of growing on me. Kind of like when you burn bacon and you eat it. You don't really like it, but that flavor that sticks around with you all day in your mouth. I thought <laughs> <laughs> you mean that not good flavor of burnt. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Got the, got the giggles. The Cheers. giggles. Cheers. 
Mine was wet. <laughs> Ew. Why was yours wet? I wasn't wet. <laughs> I don't know. Are you sure? Yeah. They all look dry to me. No, that one looks wet. Here, try it. Feels dry. <laughs> Feels dry. Mm-mm. Um, it's okay. They're wet and they taste like lemon. What? Mm-hmm. I don't get lemon. I don't get wet. They just taste like a dry pretzel shaped like a, a fish. But what I was kind of hoping for was how normal goldfish are kind of light, you know? <laughs> I was kind of hoping for that, but with like a pretzel type exterior, I guess. I don't know. It's a little dense. I think I get the lemon. I get like a fishiness to them. And no. lemon. Like when you put lemon on a fish, no. you get it? No. <laughs> <laughs> She's lost it here, folks. That's what they're like. <laughs> Yeah, fish on lemon. Okay, put that away. I'm not that getting, is not good. I'm not getting fish or lemon. It's shaped like a fish, but it doesn't taste like a fish. Okay. Just like a pretzel, but a really dry, not so good pretzel. All right, we'll move that over here with those two. They got the same <laughs> color scheme going on and same flavor profile. Okay. Now, jelly cream pies from Lil Debbie. I can get it open. Apparently we weren't going to reuse that box. <laughs> no, we can use it for its intended purpose of holding jelly cream pie. What? We're eating these and then curry? <laughs> yep. That's how we picked the video. Mm. Alright, let's... You let's smell it. Okay. Do you smell something? Me. Yeah, it smells like chocolate and cake and... There's like a pickleness about it. I am not getting a pickleness. Something is going on <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> with you. <laughs> Why are my taste buds up? Like, did you scheme something with them while I went down and heated up the curry? No! <laughs> like... Hey, I wonder if this is what the stickiness is from. <laughs> no, it was all sealed and packaged. Alright, let's go. Mmm. Ooh. Mm-mm. <laughs> no. What do you mean? That's past its prime. <laughs> mm -hmm. It is not. Yes, it is. That the cream, I mean not the cream, the jelly in it tastes like pickles. It does not. <laughs> <laughs> it tastes like strawberry. Strawberry. Strawberry pickles, same difference. Serving size, one cookie, 160 calories. And it's not really a cookie, is it? Mm, no, it says jelly cream pie. I don't know. Well, like an oatmeal cream pie. I don't like those even a little bit. You don't? For real, right. for real. Whole pack for me then. Ugh. Too much strawberry, tastes <laughs> like pickles. I don't like anything about it. If it tastes like pickles, you know I wouldn't like it. All right, next. Curry. Please, I can smell these from here. Now, what I don't understand with this curry, and I can see it like right there, there are these like cubes of things in there. But no. What, what is it? No, I can see them up at the top here. Look at that. What is Eat that? One. Potato? It could be like dehydrated potato. All right, let's get this stuff out of the way. Is it tofu? I don't think so. <laughs> Would you like some crackers? Okay, it's it's yeah. soft enough. Try one of those things you don't know what it is. Okay, I'm gonna try one. Here we go. I think it's a potato. I'm gonna smell it. Alright. You can sniff it. Does it smell like curry? I don't know. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna give it a shot. I brought you a spoon in case you wanna try the broth. Now all the potatoes down below. Steamy. Are you playing a trick on me? 
What do you mean? <laughs> I don't I'm know. smiling. You keep looking conspiratorially. Well, right. I can just look at you like this, or I can like make <laughs> eye contact with them. <laughs> the thing was sealed. How could I <laughs> do anything? I don't know. You said something about these jelly cream pies, and they were sealed. Yeah, and they tasted like pickles. Yeah, not great. What do you think of this? If it's not good, save it till I'm done eating. Hey, I don't want one of those big things. No, you get get the potato. I don't want to. You're not sure that's a potato? And... Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. That's actually pretty good. That was better than just having the noodles. It kind of just tastes like chicken noodles to me. I like the flavor. It's pretty sweet. Mm-hmm. Do you think it is? Um, yeah, there is a sweetness to it for sure. All right, try one of those chunks. I think that was pretty sweet. Like that could have been pineapple or something. Mm -mm. It's definitely not pineapple. It was really like a, there's a fruitiness to it, Here, don't you try think? try one of these things. Do you think there's a fruitiness to it? Uh-uh. What? I'm not sure what's going on with your taste buds today, but. <laughs> Ugh. <laughs> What? <laughs> Does it taste like pickles? <laughs> no, it tastes like a fruit. It does not taste like a fruit. There is no fruitiness to this. Uh, I'm taking you <laughs> into the doctor. <laughs> ah, sticky again. <laughs> All right, let's rate and rate Whew. and talk about if we would buy these things again. I hate everything. Okay. Bring those in, would you? Yeah, they're in. All right, uh, number one for me are the jelly cream pies. Number two for me would be the curry. Three would be the pretzels. And last would be these bacon habanero pretzels. Ooh, <laughs> oh, man. There's so... That's it. Guess what? That's it. Guess what? What? April Fools. What? <laughs> What you mean? <laughs> April Fools. Oh, you're joking with me about all this stuff? <laughs> about the flavors? I'm not getting any sort of pickles or nothing. April Fools. <laughs> you had me going. You had me going. I tell you what, though. If this is the April Fools prank for this year, I'll take it. No, it's not <laughs> the. It's just the one that they are sharing in with oh, us. Oh, I see. We'll see. Did you did you put the sticky on this thing on purpose? Yeah. You did? <laughs> How'd you do it? What'd you put it on there with? Well, we recently did... Uh, I see over there. You got peeps over there. That's not... <laughs> My goodness. So, I just was going to mess with John and tell him everything tasted like something he didn't like <laughs> or try to influence him in some kind of way. <laughs> And make him be like, yeah, it kind of does taste like pickles or whatever, which didn't work, obviously. I did had. I did make everything sticky. Um, it's just for fun. The, <laughs> I picked these random, like, we don't really care about stuff to go together because oh, it was a joke. I didn't know that. So, anyway. Just I've funny. been had. Yeah. I did take a peep and open it and touch, like, every... <laughs> every package with it because John hates for his hand. I hate for my hands to be sticky too but if you notice it's only sticky on this side yeah <laughs> so that I would like, remember here you <laughs> open this right you got me my mama didn't raise a fool <laughs> so my mama did <laughs> so <laughs> so now real reactions these really taste like dog treats <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't really have to act a whole lot on that. I really didn't like those yeah. at all, no. at all. No. These, uh, I also wasn't acting. They're not as bad as I made them out to be, and they don't taste like pickles, but I really don't like them. John can definitely eat the rest. There's absolutely nothing wrong with this curry at all. That definitely was a potato. It definitely doesn't taste sweet. <laughs> and these, my goldfish wasn't wet or whatever I said about it. It was fine. I was like, what? I thought she was losing her mind or something. Mm -hmm. 
Thought you were having a stroke. <laughs> Which <laughs> is not uh, out of the realm of possibility with everything that's been going on around here. Um, I get John every year on <laughs> April Fools. Yeah. He lives in fear. One year I opened our kitchen utensil drawer for like cooking utensils. There was a rubber snake in there and it scared the dickens out of me. That was our first, aww, our first April Fools together. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, can you hand me uh, the scissors or something or a knife or whatever? And he was kind of like, you get it? You're, you're like right there. But then he finally got into it and handed, yeah, he was. Yeah, scared. which, you know, a snake in that drawer. I mean, you wouldn't think so, except we found a mouse in there. So, maybe, you know, a snake could go in there just to go eat. That was a long time ago at our first house. Oh, yeah. Then one year I put crackers on his side of the bed. He was she not. She crushed up, crushed up <laughs> crackers between the bed sheets. He was ah, not happy oh, about man, that at that all. Because I was like, there's no getting that out. It's probably in the mattress now. I'm going to feel this for years. Uh, one year I took his phone and put millions and millions and millions of rubber bands. Mm -hmm. uh, one year I saran wrapped everything in the shower. The shampoo. Uh, yeah. She also took the cream out of an Oreo cookie <laughs> and put toothpaste in there. Mm -hmm. Although I, I didn't fall for that one. I know my Oreos. <laughs> Something was wrong with it. It was too squishy. One year I made a fake um, news article. There's a website. I don't, I mean, I don't have this information, but there's like a website you can go and make a fake news article. And I made an article about Star Trek being removed from all streaming services and all, <laughs> like you couldn't get it anymore. Um, yeah. yeah. I've got them like every year it's our tradition. I can't remember. Last year weren't we on... Um, weren't we in Florida last year? Because I feel like I was recording mm, I think so. when something happened and I don't I remember we what it was. I'm going to have to go back and watch if you know what it was. Let us know. I think we were in Florida. We should go back. Yeah, let's go back. All right. Anyway, so I got you, huh? Yeah. You I mean, me. it wasn't like a crazy elaborate thing. I just thought I was going to mess with you a little bit. <laughs> I just bit. kept thinking, what is wrong with her? Like, something's going on here. Yeah, which you probably weren't that thrown by it mm -hmm. that you would normally be because I haven't been feeling good. <laughs> so it probably makes more sense to you now that, yeah. you know, like, oh, well, she's, she hasn't been feeling well, so maybe it's just that. I don't know. All I know is this is super sticky. I mean, like, it's all over there. It's on there. Oh. What a mess. These are the stories that we will tell <laughs> people years to come. I, I think our kids think they're not. I mean, we don't know anybody that gets into April Fool's the same way we do. Or I do, I should say. John yeah. is kind of is like. Or Groundhog Day or yeah. <laughs> gotta, anything else. Gotta celebrate it all. Let us know if you do anything for April Fool's. And if you try to get your kids or you try to get your spouse or you try to get your parents or Whatever it is, if you've pulled off a good prank, let us know in the comments. We would love to hear. I try to do things that are kind of annoying, but never hurtful. Like, and yeah. and I don't, you know, I, I wouldn't do that like, oh, I'm pregnant or, you know, yeah. like those life-changing kind of things. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go to work and be like, guess what? You're getting out of jail today. <laughs> April Fools! <laughs> yeah, yeah, none of that kind of stuff. Just silly, fun stuff. Uh, so, anyway, um, speaking of the comments, that's the place where you can subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. We also have two other channels where we do other things a game channel, and then we have another channel where we do other nonsense <laughs> games and yeah. TV, movie reviews, product reviews, hauls, that kind of stuff over there. We'd love to have your support on all the channels, and make sure you come check us out on Instagram too. We would love to have you join us. Now, if you love pranking someone, which I don't really normally do, there are channels dedicated yeah. to pranks. And some of them are kind of like spirit. Yeah, that's not my thing. Like, I like to get John in a little funny way. Most of the time he thinks it's funny. The crackers, not so much. Not so mm, much. So now I was think a grumpy grumpy camper that night. Yeah, but now looking back you think it's oh, funny. Oh yeah. Right. It's the most memorable me one, I think. You always say that one in the Oreos. That one in the Oreos. Yeah. So, Oreos. anyway, if you love a good prank or trying random things or us, or the video. give this video a big thumbs up. 
Happy April Fool's Day, April 1st. Whoop! I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for spring. Same. Uh, that's all we have for today. That's it, guys. See you next time. Bye. Thank <music> you.